What's up, YouTubers? The Polish Piper Nick here. Coming at you on a Monday night. I've got tomorrow off. So tonight I'm going to chill out. Tonight. Tonight's video. Special one. Because I'm taking this pipe on its first smoke. It's made in voyage. The Peterson 2014 St. Patrick's Day pipe. As you can see, I've already got it preloaded. And I was thinking, what should I break it in with? Um, and I thought, this is a pretty fitting tobacco. And the, and the tobacco I chose is none other than Peterson Irish Flake. I love this stuff. This I picked up at Boswell's uh, a, a while ago, actually, eleven ninety five, and I, I love this tobacco. A lot of people say it's very strong, so watch out. Make sure you've had something to eat. When I tried this the first time, and a couple more times after that, I never had any problems. I was never nauseous, never got sick, never got lightheaded or anything like that. It's a very good tobacco. Um, yeah, so I've got that preloaded. Oh, and I want to give a shout out to Review by Bill, because he also picked himself up a St. Paddy's Day Pipe, Peterson, 2014. Not this one, but a uh, different model. It's, uh, you know, I forget the name of the shape. Uh, this looks more like a pot almost, or a brandy almost. No, no, not brandy. Pot. His is more like a, a little bit of a taller billiard bent. But uh, so I want to give a shout out to him because he got it the same day as I did. So I'm gonna take it for its first smoke with some Irish flake, and I'm gonna light it with none other than. Yes, the Bic Orange Lighter. Shout out to Pipe Smoker Stu. Everybody get an orange lighter and show it off. I'm telling you, it's the best lighter you can have for your pipe. Tobacco is just a little bit moist, but it's not bad. Right now it's out. I guess it is a little too moist. It fit a one flake in this bowl. Wow. A very effortless draw. Mm. Tony, you, you can't go wrong with a Peterson. I don't know why I didn't start collecting Petersons or buying them from the beginning. And this is my third one. Let me see if I can show up. I'll show up my other ones in a, at a, in a different time. It's got a very good draw. It's not really burning hot. It's not going to, no pipe is going to burn hot as long as you don't freaking smoke it real quick. And I've seen people smoke real quick. But everybody has their own way of smoking, so who am I to say anything? I'm just a little guy on here.
And this tobacco is just as I remember it. Awesome. I first got introduced to, uh, what's funny is I first got introduced to Peterson Irish Flake by Jason Dagner. And I got my first Peterson from Jason Dagner. I got both the tobacco and the pipe. Um, uh, on the same trip, so, so I blame Dagner Performance, Jason, for getting me hooked on, uh, the Peterson Pipes and Irish Flake. How's it look on me? Nothing, nothing, nothing else to say is that it. The draw is great. It burns great. The tobacco burns great. The bowl is cool right now. I'm taking a couple strong pulls on it. And it's and it it's awesome. It's a cool cool burning pipe. And if you don't have a Peterson, go out and get one. Doesn't matter what kind. Get yourself one of these before they go because this is just a beautiful pipe. Black stain, gorgeous sandblast, smooth green uh, rim. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All I'm, all I'm missing is some Irish whiskey. So, uh, yeah, guys, go out and get yourself one of these pipes. The Peterson 2014 St. Patrick's Day pipe. You'll see the stamp right there. Let me get the light out of the way. There we go. Let me do one of these things. No, that doesn't work. What? Go out and get yourself a Peterson. Oh, another shout out to Happy Smoking 100. No, he's a big Peterson guy. Shout out also to Brother Boontar, big Peterson guy. And hey, both uh, Jason and Jay Dagner, because they're big Peterson guys. Well, I'm going to get going before this video gets too long. Just wanted to say... It's a great pipe. Quality, quality, construction, cosmetics are on this are beautiful. I should even say that word in this kind of uh, setting, but overall, great pipe. Thumbs up. I give it a uh, 11 on the scale of 1 to 10. See you later, YouTube.